Isaiah and Lincoln, a big win for you guys on the road. Offensively, you guys did a lot of things. You, you let Chad kind of turn him loose. Offensive line-wise, how enjoyable was that to see that guy out there after everything he's been through right. to kind of be able to have a game where he can put you on his back and, mm. and do and run that way, Isaiah? Uh, I just think it was great that, like, we finally got, like, his talent. Like, we've seen it before last year, Centennial, he had a ton of yards. Like, we know he can run just with letting him be able to do what he can. I think that was, like, the best thing we could have done in that game, just putting it on his back. Like, he has a lot of talent, a lot of things he can do if the offensive line lets him. And Lake and I, you may have heard me mention the coach. They came out and punched you guys in the mouth early. They scored. They kept scoring early on defensively. What did you have to do to adjust and slow them down so your offense could do their thing? Uh, we just had to settle down a little bit there early and just do our job like we've been taught to do the whole season. And just everyone doing their job and collectively it's just when we get going, we're tough to and score on. So. You guys made a couple of stops in the second half that let the offense kind of get that two-touchdown lead. Once you gave them that two touchdown cushion, what was kind of what was the mind frame going back out there? Uh, we knew we had them on their heels, and they had to pass from there and on out because they're down. But uh, yeah, we just really put our foot on their throats at that point. Well, switching gears, this is a different kind of challenge. Permian runs the triple option. I think that's what Coach called. I've heard it called yes. flexbone. Right. You know they're going to try to deceive you and get things going a lot of different directions. Defensively, start with that. How do you adjust from what Central did to what Permian did? And I, I, I'm going to use some coach speak here. I'm sure you're going to hear a lot about assignment football and yeah. making sure you're doing your job. What it, what are the keys against Permian? Uh, just everyone doing their job and not trying to do anyone else's job or trying to do something special, but just doing your job and doing it well. How well does Permian run the triple option? Oh, they do it really good. They got some good athletes and uh, a lot of quick players. So. You don't want to get lulled to sleep by a fullback coming up the middle or a quarterback going off tackle because you know that they've got the ability to do some things. How important is that this week to kind of keep your head on a swivel as well as doing your job? Yeah, it's super important. Everyone's got their job, and we just all got to do it well. And Isaiah, you know their defense is going to be tough and nasty. Right. Maybe not as big as you guys, but what are, the, what are the keys against their defense? Just winning the line of scrimmage every play. That's how. That's with every defense. Uh, the offensive line has to get, you know, two or three yards for us to work in. I think that's the biggest part for us. The last two years against these guys, you beat them two years ago. They got you last year. This has become a little bit of a, a watermark game for you mm -hmm. guys, especially up front. Why is it important for you to do exactly what you just said to hold your own, to win the battle up front? Just to have like. Just to set a standard, and our coach talks a lot about setting reputation on film, being nasty. Like, they're nasty, they're big, but we're big and we're nasty too, just showing them what we can do. Fairly or not, Permian kind of has that reputation being the, the roughneck school because right. of the oil down there. And friendship, fairly or not, people may look at you guys and say, well, that's maybe a country club school. <laughs> Right. Do you, is this a chance for you guys to maybe say, no, we, we've got some tough guys up here as well? Yes, sir, for sure, yeah. What about defensively, we got, same we got thing? Some farm boys over here. There you go, <laughs> farm boys. Lincoln, defensively, same thing. Is this a chance for you guys to kind of put your stamp on things and say we know how to play defense up here? Yeah, definitely. Just letting the district know that we're for real and we do assignment football and we all do our jobs well.